Hi gorgeous! Happy Frugal Friday to you! In today's video I have a bunch of random dupes to share with you. I made a video like this about a month ago. It did really well. I know many of you found that video helpful so I wanted to make another one about some more dupes that I have picked up along the way. And these come from a variety of different brands including Makeup Forever, Lancome, Urban Decay, NARS, Stila. Let's just get into it. First dupe I have to share with you is for Benefits Porefessional. This is a very popular product and for good reason. It's used to cover pores on the face and smooth out the skin before foundation application. But it does come at a price tag and it's a pretty expensive price tag. So if you're looking for a drugstore alternative, I highly recommend going for NYX's Pore Filler. It does the same exact thing as Benefits Porefessional, but it is a fraction of the price. And as you can see in the side-by-side -side application here with both of these products, NYX's pore filler is identical to Benefit's Porefessional. And if you were to swatch these two side-by-side -side on your hand, you would not be able to tell the difference between the two. The only difference that I could detect between Benefit's Porefessional and NYX's pore filler is that there is a scent with Benefit's version. It smells like honeysuckle, whereas NYX's version smells like nothing. There is no scent. So if you don't like scents, NYX is another great one to try. Next high-end dupe I have to share with you is for Makeup Forever's Artist Eyeshadow in the shade D826. I've been wearing this one in a couple videos recently. It's received a lot of compliments. Thank you so much. It is one of my new favorites, but if you're looking for a cheaper version to try from the drugstore, City Color Cosmetics Marsala is next to near identical to the Makeup Forever shade. And you actually get more with the City Color Cosmetics eyeshadow than you do with the Makeup Forever eyeshadow. There are 3.65 grams in the City Color Cosmetics eyeshadow and 2.5 grams in Makeup Forever. So there you go. Fraction of the price and you get more bang for your buck. Now when I made the video last week about the Battle of the Drugstore eyeliners, someone had mentioned in that video that the L'Oreal pencil that I featured was a dupe for Urban Decay's Deep End pencil and that they wore the same amount of time, the quality was just the same, so I had to test that theory out for myself and you were absolutely right. If you're looking for a dupe for Urban Decay's Deep End eyeliner, try the L'Oreal Silkissimi eyeliner in True Teal. And for that matter, you could also try the Maybelline Lasting drama eyeliner which is a dollar cheaper in the shade silk and turquoise all three identical colors one of my most favorite deep wine lip liners is max night moth and i love it because it transforms every single lipstick that you have into a really sultry dark look but if you don't want to spend all that money for a mac lip liner can't say that i blame you you can find its drugstore counterpart in jordana's cabernet lip liner same exact color with these two. The Jordana one does require a little bit more layering than the MAC pencil would, so it's not as pigmented, but hey, for the price that you're paying for the Jordana pencil, it is really spectacular, and you get the same great look as you would with the MAC pencil. Now, if you're looking for a gold highlighting shade to use for summer, have I got the one for you to try. And this is a drugstore dupe for NARS Albatross, which is a golden, shimmery highlighting shade and its drugstore counterpart can be found in Makeup Revolution's Golden Lights Baked Highlighter Powder. The difference that you'll find between these two is actually that Makeup Revolution's is a lot more pigmented and is a stronger color. A little bit goes a long way with this one. And again, at a fraction of the price, so don't waste your money on NARS. Go with the Makeup Revolution one, you won't be disappointed. One of my all-time favorite eyeshadows has got to be Stila's Kitten. It's one that I find myself wearing over and over again. And there's a reason why everyone loves it so much and it is one of their top sellers. It's best described as this golden white shimmery eyeshadow and it pairs up so beautifully with a wide variety of looks. Its drugstore counterpart can be found in L'Oreal's Infallible in the shade Iced Latte. And surprisingly, the L'Oreal shade is just a little bit more pigmented than the Stila shade, but you get the same great results with both of these eyeshadows. And I'm actually wearing the L'Oreal one on one eye today and the Stila one on the other eye. Can't tell the difference between the two, and if I didn't tell you which eye was which, you really couldn't tell. And the last dupe I have to share with you is for Lancome's By Facile Eye makeup remover. Probably butchered that, but it's okay. I love this stuff, and I'm constantly getting samples of it from Sephora, so I've not had to go out and buy the full size, but now 
I don't have to because I did find something that performs just as well. If you go to Target, look at number seven's line. They have a dupe for the Lancome Eye Makeup Remover and their beautiful skin line. It's their oil-free eye makeup remover. You get the same exact results that you would with the Lancome Remover. Easy, effortless removal of the makeup, takes everything off the first time. No oily residue, no scent with the number seven one. You do have a little bit of a scent with the Lancome one. Just an overall great replacement if you're looking for something cheaper than the Lancome Eye Makeup Remover. Let me know of any great dupes that you have discovered recently. Drugstore finds that are just as great as the high-end ones, and now you can't bring yourself to buy the high-end product anymore. And if you enjoyed today's video, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe for more videos like this in the future, and I look forward to seeing you again next time. Have a great weekend.